support of my family and friends, and with the help of your prayers also, I plan to beat the low survival rate statistics for this disease. Messages of support today for the legendary host of Jeopardy who announced this week he's been diagnosed with stage four pancreatic cancer. Only 3% of people at stage four live more than five years, but Alex Trebek says he is determined to fight it now. 11 Alive medical correspondent Dr. Sujatha Reddy uh, joining us now to talk about the disease. So uh, you hear a lot about the pancreas, but most people may not know what it is or why this particular form of cancer is so deadly. So the pancreas is an endocrine organ, and what that means is it makes hormones, and it makes hormones that help us digest food and process sugar, namely insulin. The reason pancreatic cancer is so hard to diagnose that early on there are no symptoms of pancreatic cancer. As you see in this diagram, the pancreas is in the middle to the right of the abdomen and the upper part of the abdomen, very close to the liver and gallbladder. So early on, is there, if there's a tumor, the person may not know it, but the pancreas being so close to the liver, as that tumor grows, it quickly can wrap itself around vital blood vessels, things like the bile duct, and that makes it inoperable very quickly. And we do best with cancer when we can remove it, and that's a rare finding with pancreatic cancer. Yeah, about 50,000 people, people diagnosed in the U.S. each year. So what kind of signs can people look out for? Because I know it's hard to see. You're exactly right, and that's one of the frustrating things is the signs are a little vague. You're looking for things like abdominal pain that may radiate or go to your back. You may lose some weight. You may feel very fatigued or tired and if it gets to near the liver it can actually affect your bile production and the skin can actually start to turn yellow or your the whites of your eyes may turn a little bit yellow as you start to get a little bit of jaundice people may remember that if they have children so you get jaundice in this disease as well so those are some signs and symptoms but very often there are no signs and symptoms. All right, something to kind of keep an eye out for, especially that jaundice there. Now, well wishes have been pouring in for Alex Trebek, along with people sharing their own stories, uh, going into the doctor maybe for stomach pains. This person went in in 2015, a Minnesota man, Hans Johnson, and that's when he found out he had stage four pancreatic cancer. Doctors say rigorous chemotherapy treatment saved his life, and that's likely the best course of treatment for Trebek. Now, Johnson says a positive attitude like the one we're seeing from Alex Trebek thus far also will go a long way. Do what you, that fulfills you, that keeps you positive. Anything that's going to keep you positive and your mind focused on healing and, and whatnot, do it. All right, so what are some changes other people can do to lower their risk? I have to agree with him. I think a positive mental attitude will take you a very long way. But three things that everyone can do to help decrease your risk for all cancer, if you're a smoker, quit smoking, maintain as healthy of a weight as possible. If you are overweight, lose weight and eat a healthy diet and try to be active. That would be four, but those are things that we all should do to be healthy, but that can decrease your risk for cancer in general and pancreatic cancer. Always good advice, Dr. Riley. Thank you so much.